Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Trains with Shane on the I Saw It Online YouTube channel. If this is your first time joining us, thank you for stopping by. If you've been here before, it's good to see you again. What we have here is a little Bachman dock switcher. It's a 040 configuration. Um, very early production. I picked this thing up in a little three locomotive lot on eBay. Get this out of here. We are not going to be doing a whole lot of filming on this one um, because I cheated and did it all off camera. And the reason why is that when I received this unit, all of the connecting rods and everything on this side had fallen off and were just loose in here. And um, never having worked on an N scale steamer before, it was a, a frustrating little project for me to get these tiny little fiddly bits, especially the black colored rods, because you can't see them hardly against this black body when you're working on it. So we'll just give this a little quick overview and then we'll put it on the test track and see how it runs. As you can see, early metal wheels and it does have a, a metal worm gear, as is characteristic of the early Hong Kong production Bachman end scale stuff. Um, the light is non-functional. That's just a, um, a, a feature or a, a lack of feature of the design. It's not that it's there and it doesn't work. Um, pretty neat little unit. All four wheels pick up power. All four wheels are driven. We've got our little front mounted and rear mounted Rapido couplers. This one is in Baltimore and Ohio. So let's get it over onto the switching layout and see how it does. Rather than fiddle with putting this back in the box, I'm just going to set it down lest I risk breaking all of my hard work. All right, guys, we're over here with the little Bachman 040 dot switcher. I apologize for the wind noise, guys. I've got the fan on. It is hot in Texas. Um, as I said earlier, I cheated and took this thing apart and cleaned it and put the rods and stuff back on one side. So this is more of a just show you how it runs rather than a will it run because I know it does track power we're at pretty low power here um, switches are an issue unless you got a powered frog which I don't because it's such a short little wheelbase It's a little noisy, which is a characteristic of the early metal geared and scale Bachmans. But as you can see, it runs nice. Let's see if I can get you guys in close. It's a little jumpy, but you know what can you say? The thing is probably over 40 years old because I think that this particular machine uh, was built in the 1960s. So I want to thank you guys for joining me on this short episode of Trains with Shane. Um, a pretty cool little machine for my first N-scale steam locomotive. And uh, I will catch you guys on the next one.